If you are a leader, then it is your responsibility to adapt your leadership style to the individuals on your team. Or as a teammate, it is your responsibility to meet the expectations set upon you and to follow your leader's command. Is it both? Is there a middle ground? I've been asking myself this question for 10 years now, and I'm not much further today than I was 10 years ago. And that's because there's mentors and leaders in my life who have given me conflicting advice. And honestly, I think they're all right. I've been told that you set the expectations as a leader and you make it very clear to your team what needs to be done and by when, and then you let them do that. It's that straightforward. In fact, I was told once when I was struggling with my team and I couldn't, I couldn't get them to meet expectations, my boss at the time told me that I was a hammer and she said, Lindsay, be a hammer. Set the expectations, lay down the law and own it. Around the same time though, I had different advice from another mentor and he told me about situational leadership. That's where you adapt your style as a leader to the individual. You meet them where they're at. And I really like the idea of situational leadership because it meant that I didn't have to be a hammer and I really, really didn't like the idea of being a hammer. <laughs> I didn't want to be cold and abrasive. I mean, I liked that my team respected me. I liked that they, they called me the rock, that they could count on me when things got hard, but I really didn't like being thought of as, as cold or distant. I didn't want any space between them and me. So I grabbed onto the idea of situational leadership. But even then, you have your natural tendencies. You have to be authentic to who you are and what your strengths are. So I've been struggling to seek out what is that balance between your natural leadership style and your adapted one. I'm of the mindset that over being respected or liked by my team more than anything else, I want to empower them. I am driven. I mean, it is ingrained in every fiber of my being to help people and to empower them. I want people to be the best versions of themselves and I wanna help them achieve that. It, it, just, it drives me. And I fundamentally believe that every single person has God-given talents that are unique to him or her, that every, every person has value and purpose. So if we're going to lead someone, then it's our responsibility to tap into that to encourage that, unlock that in someone. And that might mean adapting to whatever they need at the time so they can blossom into the best versions of themselves. But I tell you what, as much as I believe that, I find myself, when I'm frustrated, under pressure when my team isn't meeting expectations, I wanna be a hammer. And so I still, very much struggle with that balance between natural and adapted. And I'm curious, you know, I don't, I don't have the answers today. I want to hear from you, my network. I count on you to give me advice and to share your lessons learned. And I'm coming to you today. So please tell me what you guys think about where does the burden lie? How do you find the balance? I'd love to know your thoughts. Thanks y'all.